Teresa Ramsey last updated 1226, May 25, 2018 Sienna McInnes, who has acute lymphoblastic leukemia, enjoys her new playhouse. Cancer survivor Sienna McInnes had a massive smile on her face when she discovered a huge playhouse in her backyard. Mum Natasha said Sienna screamed with delight, ran to the playground and spent the rest of the afternoon playing on it. Five-year-old didn't want it just for herself, Sienna McInnes left plays on her new playground with her younger sister Ava. In Sienna's words she wants a playground to share with her friends and sister, Natasha said. Read more, asterisk Sienna inspires marathon run for Starship asterisk make a wish makeover for Marshall asterisk playhouse a wish come true for young Rotorua a girl asterisk toy shopping spree for dying girls last wish the playhouse was donated by make a wish New Zealand, which grants the wishes of Kiwi children aged 3 to 17 years old who are battling critical illnesses, it was assembled in their Waitakaruru, Haureki Plains, backyard during the school holidays while Sienna was away with her nana on holiday, she knew it was arriving at some point but didn't know exactly when she is on it every day at some point great for her and her sister Ava also great for some peace and quiet for mum and dad Natasha said some aspects of the playground were built to challenge her and she will eventually grow with it it will also assist with her coordination as some chemo drugs can alter nerves in the body particularly legs when Sienna was two years old she was diagnosed with acute lymphoblastic leukemia which is diagnosed in about 40 New Zealanders each year and has a 95% cure rate receiving news that your two-year-old at the time has cancer was heartbreaking and life-altering we knew that life would never be the same again, Natasha said, we had to learn pretty quickly to make small adjustments and change our whole perspective on life, not sweating the small things, etc. Nothing can knock us down after this speed bump in our road, after treatment, Sienna is now cancer-free and thriving. Her parents have noticed a massive change in her well-being since she stopped taking medication on January 5th, when Sienna began her maintenance phase of treatment a couple of years ago, as that is the easiest part of the whole treatment plan, life got easier, Sienna was able to return to daycare and I began work again, we are just getting on with life as usual. Natasha said, it's nice to have a sense of normalcy and not having to rush Sienna to the hospital or see her deal with needles and chemo drugs regularly, Sienna does have monthly checkups and blood tests though, but they will gradually get extended to two monthly, six monthly and then yearly, as there is a small chance of relapse especially in the first year post-treatment. Sienna started school in March and is loving it, she loves her teachers, is making lots of new friends and is learning a lot. We've noticed such a huge change in her confidence since she started daycare and now even more so since starting school, make a wish currently grant around 200 wishes a year, but are dedicated to making every eligible child's wish come true. For more information or to donate to make a wish, visit makeavish.org.nz. Stuff.